Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of How Logical. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to delete your Microsoft Teams account. If you'd like to delete a free personal Teams account, which is not connected to any organizations, then keep watching the video till the end and don't forget to subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button and press the notification bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us. Tap open your Teams application and sign into your account. In order to sign into your team account, you'll need to go ahead and enter your Microsoft account's credentials. Enter your Microsoft account's password and then sign into your account and you'll be logged in to Microsoft Teams. Now, go to your profile at the upper left and tap on settings. If you scroll through all the menu, you won't be able to find the delete account option within the application. So the only way to delete a free personal Teams account is to go ahead and actually delete your Microsoft account. Go open your web browser and search for accounts.microsoft.com and search. Sign into your Microsoft account if necessary by entering correct credentials. After you're done, tap sign in. Now, scroll all the way down and tap on more help with your Microsoft account option. In the how can we help you search box, search for delete account. From the search results, tap on how to close your Microsoft account and go through the informations first. At the bottom of the screen, under when you're sure you're ready, click on close your account and verify your identity by tapping on the email option. Typing the email that is associated with your account is the same email that is displayed on the screen. Tap on send code to receive a code on your email address. Once you receive it, click it open and type in the verification code sent to you via your email. After you are done, tap verify. Go through the information one more time. Remember that just in case you change your mind, you can choose from the drop down and select whether 30 or 60 days before Microsoft permanently closes your account. During this time, the account will be marked for closure, but it will still exist. If you wish to reopen your account during this time, you need to prove your identity using your current account security info and then you'll be able to log into your account even when you change your mind after performing this step. After you're sure you'd want to delete your account, tap next. Check these boxes over here. Make sure to check all the boxes once you go through it. Select a region while you are leaving. And finally, tap on mark account for closure at the bottom of the screen. Soon after you do that, you'll be able to delete your Microsoft account and you'll also be able to delete all the information about you on your Microsoft team. But if you don't want to delete your Microsoft account altogether just to get rid of the team account, what you can do is simply go ahead and uninstall your Teams application from your device. Once you uninstall the application, you can now forget that you ever created an account for your Microsoft team. Tap on OK to uninstall. And that is how you can get rid of Microsoft Team account by either deleting your Microsoft account altogether or by simply uninstalling the application from your device. That is the only way that you can get rid of Microsoft Team. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.